Important to stress, although it's a title fight, it's three five-minute rounds for the title, held by Javid Basharat in those famous London shoot fighters shorts, red and black, famous across the UK in MMA circles. Nicholas Savio with those resplendent white shorts. He barely took his eyes off Javid Basharat during the introductions. Savio is fired up. He does not want to fly all the way over from Brazil to lose Dean, but he's got his work cut out for him as we get underway, and Savio goes straight for those legs. One thing I noticed about Savio's tape, actually, he continued to drop his hands in the dead space, which Basharat is an expert in. And he's kicking those legs, just as I said. But Basharat responded with some nice shots to the face. And here we go, it's forward pressure from Savio. He's certainly come out aggressive, but Basharat spins him and puts him on the cage. And this is where Basharat probably wants to be. Although Savio is not letting him have all his own way. That's the way to, to pressure Basharat, you know, to draw him into a fight in the phone booth, to, to put him on the back foot, as you alluded to, um, you know, and, but that's the fight IQ of um, Basharat. And again, he's got a crazy guillotine. Oh, here we go. He's got a really super tight guillotine, using the knees as well. Savio popped the head out, but Basharat opted to initiate the clinch. Nice elbow in the interim there from Basharat. Savio dabbing at the eye with the elbow, then he smiles as he can't, can't see from here. I think he might be cut. Basharat's got hey. Some heavy ground and pound from Javid Basharat. Savio's got to be careful about tackling the leg there because if his hands are a fighting on the leg, his head is not protected. He can eat some really damaging ground and pound tactics here. Oh, looking for the knee bar! Oh, he's, he's on the knee bar! He's on the he's knee bar! He's got a roll! He's pu Basharat is pushing his way out. Basharat did the right thing here. He pulled his knee to the sky to, to enable that to get the leverage off of his knee. Savio could look for a heel hook here. He's got to try and get to the, the top position, but that was close. Wow! Look at Nicolas Savio as well. He's cut wide open. Now he's looking for the neck of Basharat as Basharat looks to complete the takedown. What a crazy start to this title fight. Interestingly enough, I'd imagine that Basharat would sprawl and brawl in this fight to avoid the takedown, avoid the ground. Oh, no, he's like, it's a heavy shot, that's, that's it! it. Is that it? That's the danger of going for leg locks in MMA. If you don't secure the leg and threaten it, your opponent can punch you in the face. Man. Savio did a great job of utilizing this leg lock. I mean, I'd like to see him switch to the heel hook after the knee bar fails. He's got to be careful about the leg getting snuck, snuck out here and ending up on the bottom. I thought Savio went out there, but he didn't. He was just fighting through. He's great busted hard. up, though, Mark. He is a huge mask of crimson. I think down overhead he's going to call in the medics to check this cut, so he's got cut wide open by an elbow, and the cruel fists of Javid Basharat, who is covered in front of us, Dean, yeah. with I mean, the, Savio's the key blood. Is here, if it, can, if it goes into his eyes and impairs his vision, they'll stop it. If the cut's uh, too bad, you know. Uh, and that's it, this fight is over. Javid Basharat was on the brink of a big shot with the knee bar, but he opened Savio wide open, fought through it. In the blue corner, let's hear it for Javid Basharat.